General Motors plug-in hybrids are coming back to the U.S. in 2027. Hey there, EV enthusiasts. Welcome to EVpedia, your ultimate hub for all things electric vehicles. We're here to bring you the latest news, reviews, and tips to keep you plugged into the exciting world of EVs. But before we dive into today's electrifying content, we need a little spark from you. If you enjoy our videos, please hit that subscribe button and join our growing EV community. And don't forget to like this video. It's the green light that keeps us going. Almost 20 years after the Chevrolet Volt went into development, GM will bring back hybrid cars with a plug. Will Americans buy them? After abandoning the idea of plug-in hybrids in the United States half a decade ago with the demise of the second-generation Chevrolet Volt, General Motors will reverse course, just in time for the new federal vehicle emissions regulations and a market where it's worried about uneven demand for full EVs. The first plug-in hybrid models to be sold in North America will arrive at dealerships in 2027, GM CEO Mary Barra said in an interview with the Detroit News, the same year the new tailpipe emissions cutting rules go into effect. Coincidence? Absolutely not. Of course, GM isn't abandoning its all-electric vehicle plans. The Chevrolet Equinox EV is making its way to dealers, as is the retail-oriented Chevrolet Silverado EV pickup, and there will be more affordable versions of all GM EVs coming by the end of this year, plus luxurious models from Cadillac. The reborn Chevrolet Bolt EUV is coming soon as well. But as the regulations have changed and Americans' appetite for pure electric vehicles has gone down in recent months, the automaker's strategy shifted. Barra didn't conceal that introducing plug-in hybrids while continuing to develop its EV portfolio is purely a regulation game. Plug-in hybrids are an important part of meeting the regulatory space and giving consumers more options. As the regulatory space evolved, it made sense for us to assess our strategy, Barra told the Detroit News. It wasn't a surprise back in January when GM's head honcho told inventors that the company wanted to bring back plug-in hybrids, and it isn't a surprise now. That said, we still don't know what combustion-powered cars with an electrical plug will be available stateside three years from now. In North America, GM's last plug-in hybrid was the Chevrolet Volt, which was retired in 2019 as the company geared up for an all-electric future. In China, however, it's a different story. Here, GM sells several plug-in hybrids, and we might see a rebranded or slightly re-engineered version of the Buick Velite 6 or the Wooling Starlight sedan. The Velite 6 is a station wagon that looks surprisingly similar to the European spec Opel Astra, which used to be made by GM before Opel became part of Stellantis, while the Starlight is a larger, midsize sedan. But seeing how the global automotive market seems to favor crossovers and SUVs, the China spec Chevrolet Equinox Plus PHEV might have a higher chance of being sold stateside. In a separate interview recently, GM President Mark Roos confirmed to Inside DVs that similar PHEV technology as what's seen in China could be deployed on U.S. market cars, but it won't be the cars themselves. In other words, any U.S. PHEV models will be made more locally, not in China. What do you want to see from GM's reborn PHEV game? Thanks for hanging out with us at EVpedia. We hope you had as much fun watching as we did making this video. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell to stay up to date with all our future content. And we love hearing from you, so drop a comment below with your thoughts, questions, or even your favorite EV joke. Until next time, keep it electric and stay charged.